there are two critical issues uh, in any retaining wall system. It doesn't really matter whether they're engineered block like this, custom built stone, uh, concrete, poured concrete, CMUs, doesn't really matter. And those two issues are proper footing and proper drainage to relieve hydraulic pressure on the wall. And this particular product, this engineered block, is made by Old Castle. It's a 16 inch block, they're 63 pounds each. A very, very, very nice CMU that's designed to be stacked up to six rows high. This particular footing is 16 by 16, packed by machine, crusher run. And the uh, drainage is number 57. There are also photos, you can see other photos on the website. The, uh, large trench that you see behind here uh, is actually for the number 57 which is wrapped in landscape cloth and uh, tidied up really neatly so that none of the uh, none of the dirt that and fill that goes beyond it will uh, be able to penetrate the voids in the number 57. The manufacturer does not uh, specify drain tile but I put that in also and the manufacturer actually simply specified a four inch deep footing and since this is 16 by 16 pack crusher on it should be fabulous. So this is a uh, 18,600 pound retaining wall that wraps around the front of the house and uh, will have integrated steps on the other side. And this terracing, here's a, an example of the crusher run, that's what this particular product is in this pile and this pile has the 57 in it. It's backfilled either by my skid steer or by hand. This particular retaining wall uh, allows for terracing so that the yard can be a lot more useful and gardens can be planted. And uh, it's, very it's very lovely. This gap in the wall here is where concrete steps will go to the front door. And that's the retaining wall at the front of 407 Piedmont Street in Blacksburg, Virginia.